If you can't help, you should. That's the way that we live our lives as BBM, because we can. If we all lived that way, this world would be a better place. I think the social, new social supermarket is absolutely brilliant in our town. Particularly like to acknowledge Foodstuffs North Island and Dave and your Butterbean motivation. So you wanted to know how this thing kind of works, right? Who have joined forces to bring a social supermarket to Tokoroa to help out and to support our people. Um, so what happens is whānau who, who might need um, some help to get some food this, this week or every week if they can't shop in a, in a kind of a supermarket uh, all of the time to get what they need, um, can go and visit their local kind of services provider, might be MSD, might be a local community group, um, and they will book a referral um, through to the social supermarket, through to Nora and Dee here. Uh, we want it to be like a like being at home, like you're welcome to come in, um, especially even with the gym. Um, we know that the gym can be a scary place for a lot of people, um, so we just want people to feel relaxed and come and have a look and um, just join in whatever we got going. Um, yeah, we're here to support the community as much as they are to support us. Um, and what will happen is we'll kind of ask a few questions about how big your whānau is so we can work out how many points you need to fill your shopping trolley. For us at Foodstuffs, um, this is about dignity and about respect and about people gaining the skills and the dignity to get up and out. So say for example you're a, a large family um, of two adults and you know three or four kids and you'd get like 75 points and I, I think about that like a budget. Um, for if you were going to a supermarket. Um, so you come in, you've got your 75 points. We always start in the fresh produce because it's really important that we get um, kind of good veggies and fruit and that kind of stuff in a trolley first. Um, but you'll see there's, there's points. So you just keep shopping through the, through the supermarket until you get up to your points. Oh, it's going to be amazing for everybody, especially those in need. Um, yeah, really looking forward to the change it can make to our community and our people, and our people being everyone, not just one genre of people. <laughs> and you'll see we've got baking stuff in case, um, you know, somebody wanted to bake a cake or make some bread from home, so it's not just about getting packet stuff, it's also about, you know, how do we cook full meals to keep our tummies full and, um, you know, making sure that whanos get... Uh, good nutritious meals and everything that they need. Um, you've got household staples as well, so sanitary items, toilet paper, cleaning, all of that kind of stuff. So you can shop up to 75 points for a large family um, and then you get to take it through um, out to the checkout. And like all small rural towns, we've got um, issues of rising prices, we've got, uh, we've got uh, people that are needing a hand up, not a hand out, and something like this is, is really going to fill a gap. It's, it's fantastic. We have a koha model, so depending on the size of your whānau and the, and the points, you can um, help provide a koha back for your shopping. Um, $5, $10, $15, $20 or $25, depending on your points. Um, and then that means that we can help keep stuff on the shelves here. So it's, it's circular. Um, if we've got whānau who, for whatever reason, just can't afford that this week, then that's fine. They just need to talk to Dee and Nora and the team here, um, and we work out how we can help you anyway. No excuses! BBM, no excuses. MM, BBM. Look, I think the thing I would say to, to people who um, who might need some help is, is please don't be fuckama. I think that it takes a huge amount of courage to to say I need a bit of help this week and the whole reason that this is set up is so that it, you don't feel um, it doesn't feel hard to come and get help. That's why we're here, so please come visit your local social services, call the team here, please come. The food is on the shelves so that you can have it in your cupboards, um, and that would be a, a really awesome thing for us to, to see. So don't be fucking mad, don't be shame. It's, it's a hard thing to ask for help, we recognise that, but this is all about dignity and about you being able to put the things that you want and need in your trolley in a, in a really meaningful way.